Welcome to Rajendra Tandon videos. We continue with Meera, the poet, writing as a philosopher as well. Actually, most of the poets have been philosophers like Mirza Ghalev, Tulsi Das, Sumitra Nandan Pant, Surekant Tripathi Nirala, William Shakespeare, Percy Bishi Shelley, to name some. They think about the life's uncertainties. They also think about life's achievements. They also try to show a path to others according to their own light. Meera, in the two lyrics that we are discussing today, is telling her readers how the human life is not given for not doing anything. We are born, we do not know how it will be after death, what will happen to us. So whatever good deeds we have to do, we should do now in this life. She writes, Nehi aiso janam barambar Ka janu kuch punya pragate manusa avtar Badhat chin chin ghatat palpal jat na lage bar Birach ke jiu paath tute bahuri na lage dar Bhau sagarati jor kahiye anant undi dhar राम नाम का बांध बेड़ा उतर परले पार ज्ञान चौसर मंडी चौहटे सूरत पासा पार या दुनिया में रची बाजी जीत भावई हार साधु संत महंत ज्ञानी चलत करत पुकार दास मीरा लाल गिरधर जीवना दिन चार This lyric has some remarkable images about life. The images are taken from the game of Chaucer, dice as we call it. The images include reference to a boat carrying us across the river of life. She says, to be born a human is not is an event unique. It might not recur. It is a reward for pious deeds, known or unknown. As the year pass, sorry, as the years pass, the lifespan is shortened. Then suddenly, death overtakes. She died young. The leaves shed by a tree cannot be restored. The ocean of life is treacherous. Its currents unpredictable. Tied over it in the ship of Rama's devotion. Chant Rama's name. Tied over the currents of life. Meera says, life is like a game of Chaucer, one plays with the dice of wisdom, lovely image, dice of wisdom. The soul is the player, it can lose or win, the life is short. The saints show us the path, for your salvation follow their path. The path of devotion to Giridhar. Sadhu, Sant, Mahant, Gyani, Chalat, Karat, Pukar, Das, Meera, Lal, Girdhar, Jeevana, Dinchar. In the second lyric which I am taking for elaboration today, 
Meera talks of devotion at Hari's feet. At the lotus feet of the immortal Hari. Bhaj man charan kamal abhinasi. Let us worship at the lotus feet of the immortal Hari. Jetai dise dharan gagan vich tetai sab uth jasi. कहाँ भयो तीरथ व्रत की ने कहाँ लिए करवत काशी इस देही का गर्भ ना करना माटी में मिल जासी यो संसार चहर की बाजी सांझ पढ़या उठ जासी कहाँ भयो है भगवा पैया घर तज भय सन्यासी जोगी होए जुगत नहीं जानी उलट जन्म फिर आसी अरज करूं अबला कर जोड़ई श्याम तुम्हारी दासी मीरा के प्रभु गिरधर नागर काटो जम की फांसी लेट एस वर्शिप एट द लोटस फीट ऑफ द इमोटल हरी वट एवर यू सी ऑन दिस अर्थ एंड इन द स्काई विल कम टू नॉट the moment a human being closes his eyes at the time of death everything is just lost forever he himself is lost why visit the holy places what for go and die in kashi these are beliefs go and die in kashi you will go to heavens mera questions this do not be proud of your body or of its beauty or strength this too will turn to dust this is total vairagya the world is like a flock of birds that flies away at the sunset remarkable image a flock of birds that flies away at sunset the sunset of death the saffron robes for seeking the world to live a sanyasi's life too are of no consequence a yogi is not necessarily a wise man he too is not free from the cycle of birth and death the highest of thinking thinking of life and death in their absolute terms and of it their consequences the helpless meera prays to sham with folded hands come back to god go to your devotion be a bhakt i am your devotee she says release me from the cycle of birth and death my prabhu you alone are the ultimate savior she is not a pessimist she warns well look this happens death comes after that there is nothing it's all darkness but within your lifetime you can get happiness by concentrating on god he is the source of eternal happiness he would release us from the cycle of birth and death he is the ultimate savior says meera i request you to listen to these two bhajans or lyrics or poems read them repeatedly and find the truth hidden in these noble words jai shri krishna jai shri krishna jai shri krishna